Alright, so this is to kind of get an idea on uh, linking the fixtures window here to actually reflect what's set up in the 3D. Um, it couldn't be any easier, really. I've, I've already set this up. Um, my stage, I got some truss and a drum set and some moving heads. So, I mean, this is just one view. So, let's just kind of leave that there. Uh, go over here, uh, right click, background picture, and we will take it from the 3D. Yes. Then click OK. And actually, what it's supposed to do is what you could do is go into the positioning wizard by clicking the wand, and click on 3D. And it takes it and puts it where it goes right here. So, I mean, if I, I can now, you know, if I were to move these in the 3D, say that's too close, I want it to be way over more than that. You know, pop that over there. Go back to user mode. I click 3D again, it spreads them out. So we'll close that and you know we can you know make this a different size or whatever. Click on background picture, you can adjust the scale that way it's you know you can mess with the scale. But let's actually we'll close this off. I'll open up the wizard. Okay, well, let's, let's just say I, I didn't really want a front view layout. I wanted an overhead view layout, which I can do now. And just kind of pop that right there. Go to the background picture. Take a snapshot from the 3D. Replace it. Click OK. Go back into the positions wizard. Click on 3D, and they match. Well, I got it kind of screwed up, but yeah. And so, and that's how you can. You can also, you know, this is a live grouping. You know, I can literally take this and select my fixtures and start running stuff. You know, so let's do record you know, stuff like that. Oh, they got messed up. Alright, so pick that. Back here. Close that. Zoom way out of that. Select our fixtures. Ah. So you get the idea. And now it's reversing the output from but you get the idea. You know, these are selected. Um so if I wanted to add these add in position or take it away or clear it. So that's how you can get that to update like that. Pretty cool, huh? So, as a quick tip, 